me again, uh, hanging out here with the most interesting man in the world. And uh, I need to go over just a few things with everyone, maybe that uh, have popped up since the last video, and, uh, and and talk again just real quick. I'll try not to waste a whole lot of your time. Um, we're going to have our own set of awards as well as uh, a second set of awards from Sunshine State Vintage MX Club. First thing I'll talk about is the money it's going to cost to race. Um, it's going to cost $45 a bike to race. I'm pretty sure it's $10 ahead at the gate to get in, whether you're a spectator or a participant. Um, there will be a one-day membership fee of $10 to Sunshine, Sunshine State Vintage MX Club and a $25 entry fee. So all together, you're looking at $45 bucks for a bike. I think uh, an additional $10, up 10 bucks for every um, spectator. Um, the, the, the beauty of that is, you know, I need to explain that, that we're a separate club from these guys uh, who we are um, participating in their venue. They have their own thing. Uh, they don't want an ATC group. They're not looking for members. We have to be our own group. Uh, so we have to just pay the one day membership anytime we go to an event with them. Um, the beauty of it is we receive their awards for the motos that we run. Plus our club is going to have our own awards um, as well as prizes. We'll have t-shirts, um, trophies, everything is lined up. We've had some uh, donations from some members that have uh, made some really cool things happen here so far. We got a, a, a good sponsor, um, Central MX Motorsports is coming from Auburndale. They're going to participate in uh, supplying us with some things that some guys might not have. It looks like they might even be getting a bike ready to, uh, to run with us. So um, we'll see what they got. Uh, let's see what, what do we got here. Hang on one second. Uh, we're going to raffle a motorcycle. I got a really cool um, custom built Banshee Tri-Z crossbreed that was in uh, Dirt Wheels magazine in 2003. We're going to bring it. It needs restoration. Um, we might have a pretty good game there going on that. I hate for to see people lose money, so I'm kind of torn down the middle. Do I raffle it? Do I just sell it? We'll see what happens. We're going to have eight trophies all together, first, second, and third place for each moto, six trophies. We're going to have two trophies that people vote on. One will be uh, Best ATC. One will be Ugliest Bike. So anybody out there that's bike isn't one of the prettiest bikes headed to the, to the event, don't worry about it. Let it be the ugliest because I got a trophy for that. Um, let's see here. Uh, first 20 bikes. It, it, uh, God willing, we have more than 20, but the first 20 uh, that I have listed on race day um, by number will get a free uh, Florida ATC Syndicate t-shirt. There will be other shirts available. Anybody wants to buy a shirt, uh, we got t-shirts for 20 bucks. We're going to have blue and we're going to have yellow this time. We may have more next time. We'll see how it works out. Um, anybody that would like to uh, chip into the fund and try to help us out. Um, uh, for FLATC Syndicate at yahoo.com, you can PayPal us a donation. Um, if you want to prepay for a shirt, send me a message. Uh, we can uh, we can get everything squared away. We do need everyone's support. We we're supplying our own trophies and we're supplying uh, our own prizes and awards and giveaways. Uh, everything with the exception of uh, of what our sponsor MX Central Motorsports is, is providing. So we are dependent on our own members to help out with that because unlike the club that we're visiting we don't have annual membership fee we don't have daily membership fees we're not doing that um, and hopefully after the first couple of events with t-shirt sales and whatever we'll have enough money just to roll over right into the next one and we won't have to ask people to help out very much so uh, let's see let's move on to this bikes bikes need number plates front and rear this is a dead man switch Okay, every bike has to have a dead man switch and it has to work. Make sure your bike is right. I've already said that. I want to reiterate safety, um, behavior. We need to uh, 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 make sure I want to discuss just for one minute here. I'm going to try to leave this at five minutes so I'm running out of time. Um, exactly what's riding. There are a few members that are aware of, of, of things in front of us. And then there's a lot of guys who aren't. But let me explain, this is not a one-time MX race. This is a test. And we may get on the venue of this club with this test. 
we are approved for several MX tracks throughout Florida if we are on this venue. They will not let us come there and run our own event, which we don't really have enough um, uh, of our act together at the moment to even propose that, but they will not. The only reason we're running ATCs on MX tracks here is, is because we're on this venue. So we have to make a good impression and we have to be safe and we got to be cool and nobody gets hurt and everything goes well and we make a good impression. If we do this and we accomplish this, uh, we have several more races and tracks that we are approved for pending Sunday's results um, between now and May. And if it works out at that point, we will be more than likely on the entire schedule to run with this Vintage MX Club next season for a championship series uh, in the ATC MX class. So I'm going to let that go for now. And uh, anyone uh, um, that took the time to listen to this, thank you very much. If I forgot anything, I apologize. Uh, we'll probably have another one before uh, race day. So comment below. Let's get everything figured out. Planning on a meet, camp out, uh, swap meet the night before. Anyone that wants to roll in Saturday afternoon or Saturday evening, there's a big section in front of this place where, you can, where we can put our RVs and we can tent camp and we can hang out the night before. Uh, anybody has extra parts, bring them. You got some stuff you think some other guys might need. You got some stuff you think guys might be uh, uh, willing to buy. You got some things you want to sell. Bring it. Let, let's mix a little swap meet into our ATC group in our, in our, in our day here if we can. All right. Thanks for listening. Uh, talk to you soon. Looking more forward to Sunday than I can possibly say. Thanks.